Today, we're going to talk about three-way trust reconciliations with lien law and QuickBooks. Three-way trust reconciliations require that you've reconciled your trust bank account to show everything that has been recorded as a deposit or an expenditure and that you also have accounted for deposits and expenditures that have yet to be cleared. All of that happens when you do your bank reconciliation in QuickBooks Online. Let's start. I go to reports and find my bank reconciliation for last month. We're doing the three-way trust reconciliation for March 2023. I click View Report. Here, I see a summary of everything that's cleared. It's going to show all of our deposits and it'll show our statement ending balance. This is going to be the balance that was on the bank statement that was sent to you. You'll see your register balance as of March 31st. Plus, it's going to show anything that's happened since then. Whether transactions have cleared since that date or you have things that are not cleared. In this case, we have a $500 deposit that was not on the March 31st bank statement because it happened sometime in April. It will also show your register balance as of 426, which is the day that we did this bank reconciliation. The number that we want to match to is our statement ending balance, which is 3,500. You can see further down on this report, it'll show details of checks that have cleared, deposits that were made, and also this uncleared deposit mentioned just a minute ago. This fulfills all the requirements of reconciling the actual bank account. My first step, I save it by printing it to a PDF. You can see that this has already been saved. There's a folder, Three-Way Trust Reconciliation. That's where I put it. The next step is we're going to go back into QuickBooks and we're going to pull our balance sheet. Go back to Reports, pull a balance sheet for March 31st. I look for last month. I click Run Report. What we're looking for is that our trust account, which is this one, our new trust account shows 3,500. That's great. That ties into our bank reconciliation report. Further down, we want to see that our liabilities show that same amount. Here are our liabilities for our new trust account. It gives a breakdown of each person and their amount, and it shows our total liabilities for that particular trust account, 3,500. To keep things simple, export the report to Excel. Here is the Excel sheet. I first omit the things that aren't relevant. You see the bank balance and a breakdown of all our individual clients. Save this document as balance sheet 33123. You don't have to reformat the balance sheet. You could also just save the entire document when you're in QuickBooks as a PDF into the same folder. Most state bars require law firms to be able to show that you have a balanced bank account that's going to show anything outstanding, cleared, not cleared, and your register balance. To stay in compliance, you'll also need a complete list as of that same date, your liabilities, and all of the clients and their individual portions of that liability. That's three-way reconciliation in lien law.